Cody Deaton. I'm an instrument tech out at BASF in Geismer. I have been out here for three years total. I started out as an intern and then got hired on BASF and I thoroughly enjoy working for the company. It's really broad, the spectrum as an instrument tech and that's really why I chose an instrument tech. Um, I deal with things that calculate the pressure, level, temperature, and flow of your process. Every day I am looking at something different. I'm always running into different problems. Um, technology continues to change, so it's always evolving and I'm always having to stay on my toes. It's a never-ending learning experience as an instrument tech. Out of VASF, I feel safe working here. Safety is a huge priority. Um, in anything you do really at BASF. But as an instrument tech, we discuss safety every day before we go out to work. A day in the life of an instrument tech, I come into work, get my cup of coffee, we have a meeting, my supervisor gets all of us together, we go in the shop, we discuss the safety topic. After we discuss our safety topic, the pros and the cons of whatever that topic may be, we discuss what work is assigned for the day. And I will get my tools, my radio, my hard hat, my safety glasses, make sure my steel toe boots are laced up, get my earplugs, grab all the things I need, including my few tools, start my day, go get a permit, talk with operations to see if it's okay that I do the job that's scheduled, head outside and start working. The education path I chose to become an instrument tech was to go to a technical college and get my associate's degree. I could have chose certification, it's personal preference, it really just depends on what you want to do with the degree. I went to a technical college four nights a week, got my degree in two years and got the internship and here I am. I'm John Sluter. I'm the Director of Technical Programs at River Parishes Community College. For the students that want to enter into the Manufacturing Technical Programs, these programs are now multidisciplinary. And you need to study courses like math and science because we need students that are able to solve problems and come up with solutions based off of those disciplines. Students need to focus on the hands-on skills, working with tools, building circuit boards. These are the critical skills we need for the future. To be successful in advanced technology fields, we want students to, of course, study the mathematics and science courses, but you should also explore summer camps like robotics camps and coding camps to be able to get the technical skills we need to troubleshoot and problem solve. I would say the biggest thing and the most important thing is find what you love to do and think about what you want to do every day. So my things were, was I knew that I wanted to work on some hands-on things. I was very hands-on and I knew that I couldn't sit at a desk all day. And I knew that I enjoyed change and I enjoyed the technical side of things. So if you enjoy those things, you'll probably be a great instrument tech. BASF, we create chemistry.